How y'all doing? Hi. Hi. Good, good. I would want to start with, um, I would just love, you know, there was a roast to this season, and I would really love for y'all to roast your dad just real quick. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, we just told him he couldn't speak. <laughs> yeah, we just... <laughs> <laughs> he literally just gave us an opinion, and we were like, no, no don't that's talk. wrong. <laughs> we do roast him a fair share. Yeah. Especially this what, one. Uh, oh, what's your, what's your go-to? Me? Oh, I can come up with anything. But... Sometimes he eats his food too loud. <laughs> he does eat his food too loud. Yeah, you yeah. quiet down your eating. The, <laughs> the dad jokes sometimes are very much dad joking. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I, love and, I love it. I love it. And your it. dance uh, videos. How are you feeling about that, Mauricio? <laughs> are they accurate? What are you... they, don't like, they don't like my dad's videos. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> He's a trooper, though. He lets us roast him. I don't yeah. Mind. I, I don't mind it. being roasted by it. them. It's all <laughs> fun. <laughs> You're not a dad unless you get roasted. It's that simple. So, true. That's true. And I roast my dad all the time. Yeah. So. <laughs> Fair point. So uh, flip, flipping to a little something a little more serious, um, I know there's a word that um, I'm sure you anticipated from think pieces and all of that, but there's a word that came up in the agency from one of your people, the word nepotism. And I know that is an annoying thing to have to hear, um, but did you ever anticipate that it would come from somebody within the agency? I mean, my perspective is that, you know, these, you know, we have we have we have two different things. We've got the agency and we've got the Umansky team. Right. Um, and these girls have they're, they're going to they live and and they survive and they eat based on what they do. Um, you know, do they have, you know, the nepotism? I mean, basically what they have is the app. And I think every family has it somewhat, you know, a nepotism, but they have an opportunity to learn from me. They have an opportunity to be with me. Um, but at the end of the day, they have to prove themselves and. Each one of these girls are, are tremendous at what they do. They each have uh, their own special, you know, attributes and, and, and characteristics that make them amazing at what they do. And at the end of the day, they have to prove themselves. They're not going to have that. So, um, you know, if, people, if somebody wants to talk about nepotism and wants to be a little bit jealous, that's on them. That's not uh, that's not on them. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, we've never denied the opportunities and advantages that we have by being, you know, Mauricio's daughters in the company. But if I know... If what you're referring to, nobody said that we're trying to take over the agency. No one said that he's going anywhere. That was, I think, a little projecting much. And so, yes, there are two different things. There's the agency and there's the Umansky team. And we've been proving ourselves on the Umansky team since, I mean, I've been there since the day we opened the agency, since even before that. So mm -hmm. I put in my sweat equity in that regard. Yep. I and think people are just going to have to <laughs> tune in and see what that looks like because it gets pretty hairy, right? I mean, I clearly you like hairy, that. Hairy, <laughs> hairy. <laughs> Is that a saying? Well, you know, it was, it was, it was definitely surprising. I was like, oh, she, she, okay. Um, to hear me say that. Um, yep. Alexi and Sophia, do you have anything to add on to that? I think the whole nepotism thing is stupid. Like, <laughs> if I want to be in real estate, if I'm interested in real estate, and my dad is Mauricio, obviously I'm going to take that opportunity. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I, I was always a little afraid of that. Um, you know, of course she took this opportunity. Of course it's so easy. Um, and something that I talk through in therapy is, you know, sometimes it's not always about how you got it, but it's about what you do with it. And that's just my motto every day. And I just always just try really hard to prove myself. And, you know, I use I use that nepotism piece um, as pressure to prove myself even more. And I only expect to go where I deserve to go. So and we're doing this because we want to I love it. and we're doing it because we're good at it. So, yeah. And you are good at it. I can see it like you are good at it. And I think that's the thing, you know, people forget that everybody Everybody participates in nepotism at some point. If my if my dad had a real estate agency, I'd be working there. Like, <laughs> yeah. Down. So it, it happens in everyday life, and so I I love that y'all are able to handle it with grace. Um, and I also um, just wanted to take a moment to thank y'all um, because you're going through a lot right now, and to be able to have to go through that in such a public way is is 
I can't imagine. And I just want to thank you for sharing your stories because yes, there's the, you know, media aspect of it, but there are also families like yours going through similar things right now. Um, so I just wanted to offer that because I know you're getting a lot of questions, personal questions today. And so I just wanted to thank you all for thank your you. Thank you for that. Thank, thank you for saying that.